Let me tie my hoodie before we start. Are you guys ready? Yes. You ready? <laughs> yes. You ready? Hey. You ready, right? Yeah. Hey. You ready? Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Are you, you ready? ready to film? I'm ready to film? Am I ready? You ready? Okay, I'm not ready yet, but are you guys ready? Okay, you want to be ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? Yeah. I win? Yep. Hey, what is up, YouTube? Hey, YouTube! Ah! Guys, welcome back to another Tea Talk Tuesday. I'm with Bryce and Jaden. I haven't done a Tea Talk in, I think, two, two weeks. weeks. We have a lot of. Sipping to do. Make sure if you want to see more Tea Talk videos, like this video, comment what you think, and subscribe. Before we get into this video, we just talk about how short Josh looks right like. now. Guys, I'm not short, I'm taller than Josh. Josh is literally his girlfriend is taller than him. Dude, shut the fuck up. Short. All right, so yeah. updates on this week so far. Josh hasn't uploaded a raw content, like uh, right off the SD card. So. Yeah, I think Danielle Cohn got another boyfriend. Yes. Jaden is single as f And so am I. No one gives a shit about you. <laughs> As well, people don't let creators eat. Hey! And then there were pieces online. I was one of those pieces. Guys, trust me, it's yeah. gotten bigger since then. Guys, I swear hey. it had. I got a big dick. I got a big dick. I have to put tattoos on me so I look like a guy. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. Yo, guys, Yo what's, guys up? what's up? Charlie, you know, Lil Huddy's not straight, right? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next clip. Yeah, next clip. Alright guys, you know, keeping it in the hype house. But it's what's popping right now. Everyone wants to know what's going on in the hype what's house. Like? Do they eat? Do they not eat? Are they alive? Are no. they dead? Are they Let's figure it out. So, Thomas, um, I didn't post content for like a week, and he was like, I'm not letting you eat until you post a video. So no. Yeah. So it was by force? Yeah. So wait, my thing is, okay, if Thomas is like the leader or whatever, <laughs> they shouldn't have Uber or Uber Eats. <laughs> yeah. That's what I was thinking, just post me. <laughs> so, if someone told me you can't eat, I'd be like, no. You can go fuck yourself, actually. Imagine Thomas has those kitty locks set up on every single cupboard. No one can get in time. <laughs> no, hey, unlock. Charlie, did you post two times today? How many yes. times did okay, you? How many times did you take? <laughs> Only once. And run it back. Then you can eat. You back starving back. piece of shit. Honestly, now you just pissed me off. So you get to eat dog food. Yeah, no. I mean, I don't know if that's true or not. If it is, that's so. Kind of like. Just eat. <laughs> well, honestly, she was probably joking about it, so it wasn't like serious. You never know. But hopefully, they get some food. I've heard food's important. I heard that I did. once one time. I guess we're staying on the topic of Thomas. Hey, met him. Nice guy. Yeah. Okay. Thomas actually had an opinion on social media dating. Yeah, I'll just show you guys a video, and you can tell me what you think. You can't start dating someone with a hundred thousand that really wants to do social media because they're just gonna take advantage of you, whether you know it or not, whether you think they are in love with you or not. It doesn't matter. I mean, I can see where he's coming yeah, from, definitely. Right. but you shouldn't say that. There are people like that that use you for your club and then go And like for him to try to say like, if they have 100,000 followers, get 100,000 followers, you're irrelevant and you can't eat. Piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> so what's happening with, with Chase and Charlie? They don't have the same amount of followers. Maybe he's not a little honey Charlie ship. Might drop. I can the bird that. shut the f up? Shut the f up before we don't feed you. We won't Nah, they're still done. They, they, really they don't care. care. Wow. See, that's like you should. Yeah. To move into a positive light, I know one of our favorite couples. Elmo, Hannah, they finally met. That is beautiful. Beautiful. Wait, so they were an online relationship? You never have met. They've been dating for like almost a year. It's so dope. It's kind of cool. cool. That is cool. The that's fact cool. that they've been able to stay together and be so unproblematic. Yeah. So shout us to them. Shout Wish out. them the butt. Yes. I wish them the butt. The I best, 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 best butt them. stuff. I mean, <laughs> God damn it. All right, guys, so um, obviously we all know Sydney in this yes, house. Sydney. Don't make it sound like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a meme at this point. She ended up getting in some more drama uh, with a guy named Tate Hoover. It seemed to be a serious topic of discussion. So we're just going to watch you guys remember, like, we like to keep it light. We're, so just, we're just analyzing and giving our Yeah, opinion. we're professionalist analyst monistics. Guys, I'm giving you the situation on Sydney. I was trying to avoid it, but I guess I can't. So what happened was about a month ago, I did block Sydney on everything. We were at her one of her girlfriend's houses with a guy that she liked, and this guy took advantage of Sydney's girlfriend. Friend, under the influence, this girl took me into the room, told me I lost my shit. I don't stand for it. Ran up on the kid, got into an argument, pushed him to shove. It happened. Sydney proceeded to get in my face, defend this kid, the boy, pushed me, shoved me, spit on me, cussed at me. I had my arms out to my side. 
That's it. I went home. I blocked on everything. She proceeded to come out with a video saying she dropped her best toxic aspect friend. I responded to that by saying, no, that's not what happened. Then she proceeded to say that I hit her, threatened her, and sexually assaulted her. None of that happened. I do not deal with childish behavior, and I, I won't. I'm over it. They're underage drinking. They're hanging out two dudes, two girls. And I guarantee it. We know Sydney. She would not just push him and like shove him, spit on him just for defending her friend. There's a lot of stuff missing from that. But story. why wouldn't he make a video about the guy? Why would he make yeah, it? Yeah, why would it be towards Sydney exactly? Okay, so next we're just gonna watch Sydney's response. But Sydney was live on Instagram and she talked about the situation with the girl with that was the friend. friend. So we're gonna watch that. What you said to him? Um, well, going back to that night, not really. I just, the entire situation was taken way out of context. Um, me and him were close at the time and he was very overprotective and possibly jealous and, um, you know, just wanted to, you know, take control over the situation. Um, and what I told him was personal. It should not have been brought up or even dealt with because that was my business. And so for him to also go and talk about it online is something that I do not appreciate. Um, it should have just, it should have been handled, you know, between me and him and the other yeah. people that were there that night. Right. Um, I think she perfectly said it. It's something that should have been handled between them. And I think that's why we don't want to get into too should, much detail. TikTok group should never be posting about personal experiences, personal stuff yeah. like that. And it's not their fault because it's getting sent into them, but it should never be sent in, in the first place. So they shouldn't have to talk. And we only talk about it because it's been talked about. I, I hope they find but if the yeah, right they solution. Find resolution. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. If it did happen, let me know who the guy is. I want to talk to him with my fist. Yeah, his to jaw. kill. In lighter news, this one girl and her relationships are something me and Bryce are very passionate about. We're, she does live a movie. It's her life. We're just living in it. So Danielle Cohn got a new boy. Um, I don't care. I love her. Oh yeah, you want to talk shit to me? Got another guy. Look at Boom! This. Just moved to the Ace Family's old house. Boom! <laughs> so let's just watch the... I thought that was Ethan. He kind of looks like Ethan. He does. Those lyrics. The lyric, like, like, maybe talk about if it might make it a little bit more savage that she just got a dude that looks like her. Yeah, she's actor. like, I can replace you with this dude. We gotta pick between Ethan and Landon. I can't like, pick, dude. They look the same. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Huge fan of Landon's dad. So yeah, I'm team Landon. I'm, I'm team Landon. Landon. I'm Ethan. So talking about relationships, we may have a bud that just got out of one. Mm, Bryce. How are you, Jaden? I'm fantastic. I'm all right. I'm sad, actually. But I'm also... Uh, life's, life's a crazy word. You said a lot of things that... that words. Words. Yep, and very words. So are you and Mads dating still? No. You guys broke up. Wow. Can you elaborate on that? So basically, dope girl. Love right. her. Really do. Wish her the best. I do. Good. Um, great family. Awesome. But like... I just don't think we were ready to date each other. Very mature. I mean, we've only ever seen that maturity, I think, from Danielle and Ethan before. That is yeah. true. So, so that's why. Thank you, sir. Hey. Cut. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, right. no, I was actually going to kiss him. Uh, All right, so the most obvious thing we should have been talking about this whole time but haven't is uh, there were the internet. Ah, uh, get what? it? This like guy parts. Oh. Hey, guys, who am I? I just wanna let you know I'm still kinda softish though, so if you think that this dick ain't gonna give you the love no, you think that I'm not hard. <laughs> hey, no, no, I'm fucking I think almost everyone handled the leaking perfectly. It's you not that deep, really. The Taylor's video was the funniest on the video. Yeah, it is so <laughs> Mine was probably the most embarrassing because when I was 14, far away from the camera, turn around the underwear down like, yeah. I didn't know what I just did. Hopefully that doesn't ever happen again. Yeah. I mean, we did gain a lot on Twitter, boys. Oh, yeah, literally. We gained and I just said that me and Jaden gained on Twitter and we didn't even have our dicks out yet. Thanks to everybody that followed us on Twitter for our friends.
Thank you for the Twitter followers. Yeah, it's kind of softish, don't talk to it like that. Ah, uh, okay. Bryce, I actually saw one of your tweets that I wanted to talk about diss tracks in 2020 and your huh. opinion on them. Uh, so I made one in 2017. Yes. Crazy. Wasn't really that good. No. no. Got, like, <laughs> I want to bring back the diss tracks, bro. Bring them back. Okay. I think that it would be just fine. People need to learn how to get made fun of. We get roasted all the time. It just feels a lot better to just laugh at it. If I am doing it, it's going to be this year. It's right. going to be soon. Wait, like soon? Yeah, very soon. Do you want to hop on it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Can you split? Uh, I'll split. Jaden, yeah, there's like a part two you want to yeah, hop like on? Yeah, like you're an actual musician? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard you do music. February 26th. February 26th. I think that just reaches the max level we can on a T-Top Tuesday. It really yeah, is. That's, that's a good way to end it. Thank you guys all so much for watching. Trust me when I say I'm working on making the setup a little bit better. Actually turning it into a little bit of a show slash podcast. We're spending a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, a lot of big things coming in the future, guys. I want you to be excited. 2020, 2020 is going to be insane. Love you all later. Love you. Bye. Ah. There we go. Let's all go suck each other off now. All right, but.